Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Today we're doing another mod and if you can't tell by all this mumble jumble that's on the screen right now, it's a bit of a... Ooh, can you take a guess? It's a multiplayer mod, that is correct. So we've got a mod that came out overnight last night uh, for GTA Online. It's called um, 5M, if you can't tell by this flashing around the screen all the time. You know, 5M dash pre dev with a little uh, leaf sign at the end of it, which is quite cool. So there you go. Uh, and if you can't tell as well, this is actually online as a server. So this is um, kind of, you know, as you can tell, GTA Online. And uh, this acts as its own separate client too. So like you're not using GTA Online and it's modded through there. It's actually, um, you know, through its own system. And like it connects to, there's only one server at the moment, as you can tell. This is the first time this is happening too, like the text chat's there. I don't think they're in, in game though. Like, this is the first time you're trying it out too, which is quite weird, so there you go. Um, but yeah, so like I say, there's only one dedicated server at the moment, and that's the kind of idea of what this mod is. It's the fact that, like, you know, we're going to have our own dedicated servers, rather than using uh, Rockstar's peer-to-peer -peer bullshit. So there you go, which is quite awesome. And as you can see, we've got this graph down bottom right, which you can obviously tell what it's for, which is your ping to the server, you know, you've got in-out. Uh, coolest bit, obviously, to do is you've got your player coordinates at the top left, and you've also got session started. Yeah. Not yes, not no. Yeah, so there you go. That's the kind of professional stuff we like to see. So there you go. Um, but another note I should say is the fact that this is also, as you can tell by it flashing around the screen, this is pre-dev, which means it's li literally just came out. And as a lot of people are saying, it is the bare bones of the mod so far. They, were, they are working on it at the time. This is kind of just like a proof of concept that the fact like you know, they're doing it. This is how they've got so far and they're doing more to come. So there you go. But it's really too easy to install too. Uh, I'm sorry I'm just driving around and this is boring gameplay, <laughs> sorry. Um, I don't know what you want. I mean, I could find more players, but I, like I say, this is the first time we're doing it and like, you know, the text chat's working, but I don't, I can't actually see any game characters inside. I know it does work, people have got it to work, but this is just me playing on my own the first time I've got it, so, you know. But anyway, moving on. The way this works is uh, to install, down the links in the description, feel free to go ahead and download this. Um, if people are going to ask this ahead of time, I'm going to answer it ahead of time because uh, I saw this on uh, subreddit and I'll permalink the uh, guy who said it just in case, you know, I'm misquoted or whatever. But apparently you cannot be, um, you know, um, what's the word? Banned. There you go, that's the word I'm after. You can't be banned because this is actually using its own separate client, hence why I said it earlier. So you still sign into Social Club, so if I press home, you'll see I'm actually still signed into Social Club. But... Um, you know, this is connected to their servers rather than to Rockstar's stuff, so I'm guessing, I don't know, like, top of my head, I don't feel like it would not stop you from getting banned, but, like, I can't say for sure, and obviously use at your own risk, so there you go. But anyway, the way to install is really simple and easy. I think you can do this, I've done it the normal way, which is you just drag and drop it all into your Rockstar root server. Uh, uh, root server, root folder, and what that'll do is that'll, you know, put all your folders in there, and, uh, you know, it also obviously replaces script hook too, I think, so it's got its own in there. And uh, it also has its own uh, citizen IV.exe, I think it's called. And what that is, is you actually use that to actually run this. So if you load up the game normally, it's not going to work. Whereas if you load up the game using that citizen IV.exe, what's going to happen is uh, it'll load up and it'll also obviously sign you into Social Club. You know, that'll come up. And uh, if you'll know if it's worked, it's because uh, the interface will be white. If I press escape to show you, the interface is kind of white and blank like this. Now, that's obviously a bug, I'm guessing. Or it's intentional, I don't know. Might be intentional, might not be. But you'll know if it's worked, if it's white anyway. Um, so there you go. And just bear in mind that this is the first public release of the pre dev as you can tell, um, right now. So just take your time. If, you, if there's any bugs or whatever, if you can't get it to work, then... You know, just give it time, in other words. Like I say, this is kind of like a proof of concept release at the time. Um, but yeah, so like I say, you just got to go to forum.citizen.re. Like I say, link in the description if you want to try this. Um, if you can get it working with friends, good, congratulations. And get the text chat working, as you can see. Um, so, so there you go. Um, but I just can't get to, get to see, um, you know, the characters working either. So I, I don't know what that's about. But anyway, guys. So that's, um, you know, that's 5M, really. Which is multiplayer mod for GTA 5. Coming out relatively soon. I'll probably give it maybe two or three months and then might have a really good version, possibly. Because they've done this in possibly like what, two, three, two, three weeks maybe since it's been out? It's probably gonna be here about three weeks now. So there you go. Damn it, I've gone the wrong way. So yeah, it's been three weeks since the game's come out and they've been working on this for three weeks and they've got this far, which is really good. And you just gotta bear in mind there is one dedicated server. So, you know, as it, as it gets, as time goes on and, you know, more people want this mod to come on a lot, a lot more, they'll obviously add more servers work on it faster as possible, you know, you get the idea and all that stuff. 
so there you go. But anyway guys, that's 5M, like I say, links in the description if you want to download it. Um, if you've got any problems, <laughs> best not ask me, but I can obviously if you comment and I can try and reply and, and give you a response, so there you go. But anyway guys, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, leave a like if you did and subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys, hopefully, when this gets updated more, so there you go. So goodbye for now. Say I am.